Yo, what's going on guys? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy Broadway coming to you guys with another video, man. And today, I told you guys I was on my new journey, that I was on my new spiritual journey, and that I was going to grow a lot more during this journey than I did in my first journey. So let's get started, man. Today, we're going to talk about 1111. Why do I keep saying 1111? Like, I see it on the clock, I see it on license plates, I see it on receipts. Why do I keep saying 1111? One reason you're saying 1111 is because in that moment, you have to be aware of your thoughts. Be very, very careful of what you're thinking about when you see 1111. Like, as soon as you see 1111, immediately, what am I thinking about? That's what you need to be thinking about when you see 1111. At that very moment, you are manifesting your thoughts. And it is a very, very, very powerful synchronicity. Number two, a second reason you could be saying 1111 is because your, your angels or your spirit guides or whatever you like to call it or you prefer is trying to contact you. They're trying to let you know something. This is a wake up sign. This is what I call number two. It's a wake up sign. A lot of times, I know for me and my personal experience, when I first started seeing 1111, it was around 2012 when I was becoming aware of it. Like, wow, I'm really seeing this number way more than I'm used to seeing it. Why am I constantly seeing it? It was a, a calling for me to, to go into my spiritual side and learn more about who I was and who am I like, and where I come from, man you know just going back to my roots so it was really more of like a spiritual awakening if you want to call it that's what i call it everybody calls it that you know what i mean but people must understand before anything can happen out in the physical it has to happen on the inside first in the spiritual world so just think about that now by me doing some of my research i've seen some people say that it implies that you could be a star seed, you could be a indigo child, a light worker, you could be a wanderer. Now, within these things, I know those are all labels, but those specific concepts, I guess you can say, is basically saying that you have a bigger purpose in life and that you're here for a mission, that you're here for something bigger than what you really think you're here for because if anything that I'm saying in this video is making sense to you guys and it's resonating with you guys, you you are one of those things. You are a light worker, you are a wanderer, you are a star seed or an indigo child. When you see 1111, let's say this is the third. This is the third. They also say that when you see 1111, you have a lot more synchronicity, synchronicities within that uh, present moment when you see 1111. Now, what that means is you're having a lot more dominant thoughts that are happening inside that are manifesting out in the physical right then and there. Example could be you could be thinking of a song to some lyrics or something and you could be in the car riding and all of a sudden you hear the song come on on the radio right then and there as you were thinking about it. That could be a synchronicity right there. So that's just an example as well. So that's pretty much it, man. I hope I helped you guys with this video uh, on why do you keep saying 1111. If you guys have any more questions on this topic, please leave it down below in the comments. And I'll be sure to get back to those. I may even make another video. So that's just letting you guys know that up front. But yeah, man, if you're new to the channel, if you like the content, make sure you subscribe, man. As always, give the video a like, a thumbs up, and yeah, man, I'll see you guys in my next video, man. It's your boy Broadway. I'm out. Peace.